My name is Rachel LaCour Neeson, and I'm a wedding photographer in Atlanta, Georgia, and my studio name is LaCour. Um, when I arrive at a wedding, I'm usually really nervous. In fact, I usually start getting pretty nervous the night before. There's so much pressure and I want to do a great job. And beyond that, I think that I'm so aware of the fact that I have to be both a photographer and a psychologist. My first responsibility is to make the bride and her family and friends feel comfortable with me in a really intimate setting, which a wedding day is incredibly intimate and incredibly emotional. You know, my passion for photography actually started when I was in high school. I fell in love with the idea of not only traveling and seeing world history unfold, but also, more importantly, to photograph intimate uh, situations in people's lives. It was almost like um, an open door or an invitation into someone else's story. This was more true to my training in journalism than anything I had ever done for newspapers or magazines. And so the wedding felt like the most natural thing for me to be photographing. You know, I think that what drives me to, to make images, I know that I'm uh, part documentarian and part historian, and really the difference is I just happen to be using a camera rather than a pen to, uh, to tell the history of a family, because so much of history has to do with telling stories. And you know, an image, when you look at it later with your parents or grandparents, they want to tell you about what they were feeling when that image was taken of them before you even knew them. And that's so cool to me that I get to do something that's just a small part of that family's long-term history and legacy together. My think tank bags are like a favorite old stuffed animal that you, you know, you drag around with you as a kid and, and you love it and it's kind of beat up a little bit, but you know that it's gonna last. You know, when I arrive at a wedding and I'm already so nervous about doing a good job, the last thing I wanna be worried about is like whether my gear is organized and safe and if I can access it quickly and respond to a moment that may be happening in front of my camera. So when I uh, typically roll in with my airport international bag, I know that it's um, all of it's ready to go. So all of the uh, gear is organized exactly where I know it should be. And it's discreet enough that I can park it in a corner and then use a lens changer bag. And as a female too, I feel like I don't want a bag that makes me feel like I'm going on safari or that I'm like, you know, shooting a war. I always know that they're not detracting attention um, away from the bride and her family and friends. It's just uh, blending into the background. So that's why I feel so comfortable with the gear and the think tank equipment that I'm using.